and then we just take that back off once we're tested. The two inch is a bit of a different process because we don't have the 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 um, the <coughs> four inch. We would build everything, leave it inside the liner, test it, and then pull it back out. But with the two inch, it's a little bit tougher to do. So we're putting plastic over the bladder just so we can air test the bladder. Just so we can air test the bladder. And we probably will not take this up to full. Pressure. Right. No because they just yeah. yeah yeah you just want to test your ends and right that's it take right. like six pounds let it inflate let it sit for a few minutes uh, it'll probably take about 12 pounds okay to get it to at least where we can test our ends okay we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna have plastic on this uh, anyway won't we no nope. it oh, all okay. comes off there's no plastic on a two inch okay just the end caps okay. four inch three inch four inch six inch has plastic running right through the whole thing well, why and is that? that so epoxy doesn't stick to silicone Okay. Which is the bladder. Right, which is the bladder. Okay. So we don't need plastic. Plastic is a barrier to keep the EDPM rubber, which is the lay flat black that I told mm -hmm. you about. If, if you didn't have the plastic, that stuff would just be permanently yeah, stuck so, to the inside. Yeah, who told us about that? No, no. So why do we have to do it on the three or four inch though? Because it's different. The different rubber. It's black. It's oh, a bladder. Okay. Rubber. It's the black. I we're going over that. Again. I thought you were saying the old product had a black. I thought that the no, three no, or four no. inch still use the same. Nope. Okay, got nope. you. I got yep. you. It's, okay. a, just a, it's a different rubber system, only because silicone is like 10 times more money than EDPM. So, so this would be five the... times the price if it was four inch and you'd be throwing bladder away. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. Got you. And you can't reuse these bladders? No. No. Because when this epoxy cures up, it's like glass. So it's not like the permaliner stuff or some of the other stuff that use, they use a vinyl ester resin. This stuff is hard, hard, and it's a knife edge. So when I was doing some training down in San Antonio, we, we did a gapping and then we did a blind install like this, but it was on the shop floor and there was resin bleed all around the inside of the two inch connection. Shredded it. As soon as we blew it up, just cut it. It's just, it's, it's a razor knife edge. If you have a bleed, that's a knife edge and it goes into an opening, which is why if you're, if we were doing the four inch here and gapping it and then pulling liners down to it, we would put chains in there to knock any of those raw edges off. Cause they just shred, it'll just shred your liner. Got yep. you, yep. got you. Or you're not your liner, but your, um, your bladder. bladder. Yep. Okay, so we got to plug in that compressor. 